Hello everybody, it's me, your favourite mental cancer person. <laughs> I've been at Asda, spent a small fortune again on fuck all again. There's a couple of things I could have done without getting though, so that's on me. But I do like to treat myself now and again. Anyway, how's everybody doing? I know I've got a few new subscribers and I'm going to say thank you and hello to you. Welcome to the family. Um, if you don't know, I, get, I do get a bit sweary, so I warn you now. If you're easy offended, you can go and do one, basically, because this isn't the channel for you. <laughs> this isn't the person. I shouldn't be watching it. Ooh, just popped up. One is 50% sale. Keep away, I'm, keep, I'm trying to keep away from the sales because I am trying to save up. Um, I'm just rambling now. I've got a haul to do. I've been, like I say, I've been to Asda. I've got another haul to film because yesterday I was in the Metro Centre and I went to the entertainer and I popped into BMs for a few bits and even went the range, but I didn't get much. I got like three things. And one of them was two of the same thing. Um, I'm going to film that later for the weekend, so there's something up for the weekend. I don't always do that. You might think, oh, she's this mad shopping person. I'm not, actually. Um, I'm trying to see what money to go on holiday next year. I want to do the fjords, which is like me dream holiday, but it's going to cost a fortune. It's going to cost... I, I worked it out, and it, come, it comes to nearly 3000 I don't know where I'm going to get that from, but it's what I need to do. Because I don't know how long how long I'll have on this here due to this fucking shitty disease. <laughs> um, so I want to do a little bit travelling while I'm here, while I'm still able, while I'm still fit enough to it's caught us off the nursing home, you know what I mean, the hospice, which is where I want to die because I don't want to die in the hospital because it's a fucking depressing place. The staff are lovely, don't get us wrong, but it's a depressing place. So I've done, I'm trying to go sort out if you I'm saving up for that. So I'm going to see if I can get, do like a plan with the funeral directors. I live in area, you know what it is? In about five minutes more from us, I've got three funeral directors. I've got one page ago, which is the odd, odd one where you get the brightly coloured coffins and that. I've got a, an independent across the road and an independent beside the page you go one. So do you think they'll tell me something? You know, because we have got the old folks, like, no one of them insists they live in block of towers where you're still able and you've got, like, a string and you can call somebody up. We've got one of them, so I think it's, like, they're just hovering around like vultures waiting for them to drop because once you get in, you don't come back out, you know what I mean, unless you're in your coffin. So yeah, I'm just rambling now, because I'm, I'm kind of thinking out the fucking sea, basically. Uh, do you ever get like that, where you like, you talk to people and you think, fuck, I've got no to see, I think I've said it all. See, I'm doing it again, I'm just rambling, 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 ramble on. And I know people think I'm a bit nuts and I don't really care. <laughs> Be fucking family thing is that anyway? <laughs> Sorry, the alarm is just starting, isn't it? Um, I'm just talking for no no good reason now. Um, earrings of the day, uh, my flingo ones, really nice. So got to pay my niece some money because I'm going to Centre Parks just after the Chris after the New Year for like uh, four to five days, and we've we'll got a lodge and we we'll just split the payment play, payment between them. So it's come to about it hasn't come to much i'm not going to mention how much but it hasn't come to much and uh, so you've got that to pay for but i'm going to enjoy that tonight for winding down you know the madness after christmas and the new year i'm going to go there and chill out um there's no there's just some walks and the pool just go and chill out, play game, play ball games, things like that. You know, just have a nice time. And have a nice time with my sister. Spend some time, quality time. Uh, right, I'm going to get on with the haul. A couple, of, like I say, a couple of these things I didn't tackle, I didn't need, but I wanted. And sometimes you have to treat yourself, even though you're going through those bad times or the 
money and things like that. Like, ah, but like I say, I've tried to save up this, for this cruise, but it's really hard. Plus, I've tried to like, get me, I've got to try and sort me out me, me passport because I've never been abroad. So, this will be like, uh, this is a big thing for me. You know, like getting my pass my first passport, um, like planning and all, which is hard. I've got to book that right all down in. I'm watching all these videos on YouTube of all these groups and I'm getting a feel for I'm getting, oh, I want to go. <laughs> Did my video for uh, my second count last week, last Monday. It's nearly up. It's I've just seen the final draft and it's really good. It's just short, but it's really good. So if you don't know what my second count is, it's a charity for secondary breast cancer. Not just for women, for men, because men get it as well. Uh, because it's not really talked about, like other, like normal, like your primary breast cancer is. Because if you did, you were fucking scared by your shitless basically. Anyway, I'm gonna do, a, I'm gonna do a separate, chatty video about that, and I think if I'm working my way down. So if there's anything you would like to know. Please send us a question and I'll do my best. I'll write it down and I'll do my best to answer it. So if there's anything you'd like to know, please send us a question. Because I, I, it will be a quite a long video. So I, I would like questions and I'll give you my answer. Right, now let's get on with the haul because I haven't got that much time because I've got to get up away and I'm going to babysit. Right, um, I bought a new bath towel because they were cheap. It was £2. Just... Blue one because my bathroom's blue. It's a very dark blue. It looks like a it's like a gothic colour. It looks gothic. So got that because I do like colour. Um, that was two pound. Got this cushion. I know this cushion was ten pound, but I had to have it because I do like bees and it's like green velvet and I love velvet cushions. Nearly all my cushions are well, all my cushions are velvet, of some sort. And I love cushions, and like I see, you've got treats on them. Look at oh, it's all soft. Oh, let's put that there. And my partner will come and you go, Oh, no, 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 a cushion. And I'll go, Yes. <laughs> the, cushion, the cushion monster has arrived, has been again. My cushions have acted, have had intercourse and multiplied. Right, right, that's how my mind works. I'm warning, I'm warning the new subscribers now. That's how my mind works. I think I've got 19. I've had 11 last week, I think, and now it's 19, so. I must be doing something right. If you're coming back, I'm watching this. Um, these were one fifth. Oh, no! I got the wrong freaking ones. I can't eat. I don't want them. I got four boxes of them. Oh. Oh well, oh. Right, uh, I'll keep them for treats, I'll give them to the kids or something. Got a pack of Muller Lights, £1.15. So that's like £5 bloody wasted day. Eh? Well, it won't be wasted. It's because me, I don't look, I, can't, I don't take me, I should wear glasses, but I don't. £1.15, they were on sale, they were like uh, on, over a pound. Off. So I've got the strawberry ones. I don't really like the mother like lemon ones as much as the as Aldi ones. So I'm going to give the strawberry ones a go, see if I like them. Um, so these were £1.20. Some sponge fingers. I'm going to make a, a low fat tiramisu. Just a small one for me. Um, Another box of toffee skinny whips. I think I'll take a couple of boxes up and my daughter's for the kids. Okay. Um, 185 for six eggs. Eggs are getting expensive. Um, I've got two jars of coffee. Not once for me, once for my daughter. These were £3 each. These used to be under three pound. These are just close to show. Things are expensive. One. These pickles. These were one fifty. 
these are really nice sweet and sour ones and they're normally well over to nearly three pound of things so they had them on special so i bought them see i don't mind but if i can get them on special then i'll buy them like that i wouldn't normally pay that i'd buy the cheaper brand but even the cheaper brand was like it's over more than what they cost so um some wonky chomps for my daughter's dog they were 129 um food traders these were 175 for six packs so you got like you saved over a pound but if i'd bought the one with the three packs it was 160 so i've got this one with the five packs in sorry so it was like 25p for an extra two packs so i've got them uh, sweet nut that was 69p that's my daughter as well uh, some pasta caught in one pea that's on the door yeah, because she's doing the kids well I'm doing the kids cheesy pasta and I don't know if she's gone enough to have to make a big pan because they're freaking like animals and kids honestly um, two more packets of skinny whips I'm going to basically I don't really like them that much they're quite hard I think there's something to do I'll do some sort of pudding or something skinny whip put them in some baked oats and let them melt oh that sounds quite nice watch your space one uh, pepperoni pizza 125 I buy this from my grandson he's coming tomorrow he's going to be squirting barbecue sauce on so picked up a Nasda magazine three bananas because I've got some that aren't very ripe, so I thought I'd get these for the be breakfast and I'm going to make some banana and peanut butter bites. Stick them in the freezer, see how they be because I'm, I've got a really sweet tooth and mother's like being on a diet. It's like, <clears throat> you know what I mean? I'm looking for like alternatives to have. So, anyway, uh, let this, uh, this was 50p. Let this at the weekend for salad. Raspberries, these were 170 because of the. No, well, 170. Yeah, they were 170. You think they would have been cheaper with the as essentials, but hey ho, no, they weren't. Um, strawberries, I don't know how much these ones were. Uh, these are 400 grams. Oh, God, I hate having a look. Strawberries. These ones were £2. I like the big boxes for £2.85, but they didn't have any in. So, 60 pence for a small pack of cherry tomatoes. You all know if you watch, I love me tomatoes. So, all stock up every time I go shopping. Some cheap ham for me grandson in case he wants a sandwich at the weekend on Saturday for his dinner. I don't like that stuff myself. If it's not eaten, I'll give it to my daughter's dog and eat that. And you can see, one of these, but I actually don't, I actually have very little food waste because I try and use everything. Like even the skins and the tops of these, put them in the back, stick them in the freezer. Then when you're making a soup or a stock or something, stick them in. You know what I mean? It saves having to pay like money for stock cubes. Just do that, stick them more up, make your own stock with it. Uh, 120 for these, these Robins are Robin bastards. Used to get five for a pound, now it's four for 120. Tell me why, why, why? The top the other one. <laughs> Sorry, it's a bit of a bugbear with us about that because I think that's just disgusting. Um, 150 for some Oxo stock pots, that's cheap because they were like. I think we were pulled off, so I've got a pack of them and then my favourite stock box. I see, I like the little nice, really nice stuff. But if, if it's too expensive, I won't buy it. If I can get it cheap, then I'll buy one or two something. Some peppers, these were 169 so these. They had red peppers, but they were 75p, but my God. 
you will you will be lucky if you got a deal out of them. They were like all of them were open. Um, cheese in one pound ten for some also cheese in crisps. Not for me, for my grandson. I can not eat these. Um, one pound ten for some quark. This is what I'm going to use to make a tiramisu with. You can use it for also. It's like it's a soft cheese, right? It's weird, but it, I wouldn't eat it like that. No way. But you can make it into sauces, and it it takes on flavors really well. So if you want to mix in like some, I'll use flavor drops. Like a drop like pudding, you get all all sorts of taste like banana and all sorts. So you can make that like a mousse. It's, it's dead thick as well, so it's really, really good. Um, gammon, because I'm going to do some soup next week. We're for 5 25 for a thing of gammon. These used to be £4. Um, so I could use half in the soup and cook half and do gammon and chips or... I'm thinking about it, doing some gammon and beans, which I've got some gammon in the freezer, which I cook, so smoked gammon. So I'm going to do a uh, smoky gammon beans, like baked beans, but like really luscious. Two pound bog roll. I like this. I don't always get it, but I do like this one. It's uh, supposed to be four. You know, like it's that kind of stuff. So two pound for that. It's down, it's down from 2.15, so uh, 2.29 for some chicken stir-fry strips. Um, yeah, I'm going to probably do like a chicken stir chicken noodles I'm on the team, so I'm going to keep that. Oh, I have to read that when I'm finished. I've got a message from... We can to support group uh, one thirty nine for some soft and sweet kiwi fruit ready to eat. No, they're bloody not. They're like bullets. They're solid. So I like them fringy. I like them on my breakfast. I eat a lot of fruit. Eighty p for the mushrooms. We had twenty p off, so I had to pick the up. Some of this stuff, quark, it's quark basically, that's what it is, it's very high in protein, but if you're on slim wheel and using this, it's half a sin, but it's easier, sometimes I just want something ready to stir it around, put it on top of food, you know what I mean. It's small these were one pound fifteen for some four fat free Greek style yogurt. See, I buy the big things, and like I end up hot, you know, full and half of the way because I don't use it in time. So these little pots are perfect for me. I can just have one or two, but then I won't be wasting because they last quite a while. So that's like a frugal tip for you. Um, these were one pound thirty nine for um six. Got sweet and juicy guy. I've got some apples, but they're starting to it. So I'm going to cut them up. I'm going. I've seen this thing where they made brownies out of apples. They blitz them down. Add cocoa powder and an egg and some red celery, and they made really nice and they look really fudgy. So I'm going to try that. So that's like. A lower fat option of brownies healthier. You know there's a lot of sugar in fruit, but never mind. Leaves uh, for my soup next week. The corn though, the date's only 30, but I'll stick them in the freezer. So um, one sweet for my soup. Very small, 65p. The leaks were 50p. Sorry about that. Um Another quag white chocolate. So that's like for two breakfasts there. Um, got one of these little tin pie dishes. They were uh, two pound, and I love these enamel tin pie dishes. I've got another one, and they're right 
just the right size for like meat and pie for me or a crumble or a dessert so um one thirty nine for some no these were a bit more expensive these ones no one thirty nine I was right I could have got the cheaper ones for like a pound but they were like hard and like they were like like little ball bound no taste so I'd rather pay the extra I won't use as many and they're much sweeter and plumper and juicier and if it comes to the time I haven't used them all I'll stick them in the bag in the freezer so um, couscous I don't know how much this was I don't eat a lot of couscous by the way um, where are you couscous 80p for me couscous so that's not bad I'll get like I get probably for myself eight meals easy out of that because I have it with spicy veg which I do in the oven spicy veg and mix with couscous with spices and it's really nice and I'll do sausage with it sausage balls or chicken or um, sweet or cabbage that was uh, cabbage 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 70, 70p I do like the sweet or cabbage. I'm trying to get the onions. Spring onions, 50p. These were a pound. I think they were a pound anyway. Pound. So we were 65p and the spring onions, yeah, were 50p. So everything's right on track. And the apples were one thirty nine, so just to like keep it courgette. These are quite cheap. These are cheaper than as for than Aldi. Um, courgette ninety five p. Cheaper than at Aldi because of one pound something at Aldi. So not everything is cheaper than Aldi. It should Aldi should do a, do Aldi do a price match? Right, I'm getting. I'm going to save some money. We do. Um. Dog food, this was 80p, it's for me daughter, for our dog food stash. You know, like I always buy a couple of tins and like stick it in for her. Because money is tight at the minute and Christmas coming up. You know, it's got a half decent job, it's still, it's still feeding the burn by taking pays rent and cars and insurance and tax and everything. And they don't get any help off the government. So... And I got dirty fry seasoning. This was a pound, so I thought. I'm making dirty fry tonight, so I thought I'm going to give this a go. And that is all a whole, and it's complete now. Um, that came to... Uh, originally came to 74 77 but I did put £5 on my savings card. So... Uh, came to, in the end it came to 79 77 you don't know what savings card is you get, get a card as that put money on whenever you want save up for the Christmas that's all I do. I've got a hundred pounds on it now so that would do me for the Christmas I don't need to worry about food or anything for Christmas now so that's all done and that was me whole and all of the whole and I hope you've enjoyed it Um. Right, I see I'm going babysitting after this. Um, I'm thinking the content to do for this chatty video I want to do about the cancer because I don't know if you all know, well, you all know, but you don't know the ins and outs of it and I'll tell you so. I'm going to ha like look for the, the facts and stuff like that. So I'm going to have a look and write it down and work it out. So that, that's in the pipeline. Um... Like I say, later on, I'm going to come back from babysitting and doing another haul video. Probably be up Saturday or Sunday, so look out for that. And I think that's it. Um, I'm, I'm going to go now and put all the shopping away, then have a nice cuppa and something to eat. And then I'm off babysitting. So you know what I'm going to say? Be good, be kind, but most of all, be excellent to each other. And you know what? Just be a nice human. Bye.